we're gonna go up into Betatakin. That's up in the ledge up here. We're in Arizona in Navajo. Navajo National Monument. Um, Betatakin is a Navajo word meaning ledge house. And it's in Segi Canyon. Segi means in the rocks. Um, actually, the word Segi actually means rock. I believe. <laughs> but in this context, it means in the rocks. And Betatakin is the Navajo word meaning ledge house in this canyon. Now, that's a Navajo word, but Betatakin is not a Navajo place. It's actually a, um, an ancestral Puebloan place. And the uh, ancestral Puebloans call this um, Talastima. Talastima meaning um, blue corn ta place of blue corn tassels and what else can I tell you about this uh, the ancestral Pue Puebloans called themselves Histasinom so Navajo called them Anasazi the people called themselves Histasinom and uh, we call them <laughs> ancestral Puebloans <laughs> Everybody has a name for everything. Now, the visitor center will tell you that uh, the Navajo, the, so, so Betatakin is, uh, or Talastima, is, was occupied um, for only about 50 years, around 1250, around, around that, those years. Um, and the Navajo came through here thinking that they were, later, later, they came through later, thinking that they were coming to, um, through, through some virgin landscape. And when they arrived, they saw these things. They saw Batatakin, they saw Kitsil, they saw a lot of these other little houses and realized that somebody, the Anasazi, the, um, the old ones, the, the, the people who came before, uh, they, somebody was here. So then they also used this land. Now, that's what the visitor center says, but our Navajo guide today says, no, that wouldn't happen. No, because if you have, um, if you come to some place and you see something created by somebody before and you don't know who they were, there could be spirits of those people still occupying that place. So you wouldn't go there. That might bring sickness. That could be, bring bad luck. You would leave it alone. So, whose story do you believe? <laughs> There's one more thing I wanted to tell you, I forgot. So Navajo, that name, also isn't the right name. The correct name for the people is Diné. Uh, Navajo is a Spanish word that means raiders. <laughs> Would steal all the cattle and the, and the uh, you know, sheep from the, from the Spanish. Uh, but the Spanish never stole anything from them, did they? <laughs> raiders, Navajo. I love this. <sighs> Diné.
Okay, there's one set of each over there. The holes for loom, loom holes, is that what you're saying? Loom anchor. Loom anchor holes. And the men did the weaving? Yep. Oh, yeah. right there. Yeah. Now, uh, now one folks did the weaving. Right. Wow. Do you see it? Oh, oh, I see what you're doing. Then there's one of each over here. Uh-huh. See? Oh, yeah. And those are the footholds mm -hmm. right there. Petroglyph. Where are the footholds? Um, Petroglyph. It's, um, the footholds are right there, right on the corner. Oh, uh, they're darker. See them? Right on the very corner of this, this square rock right here. They're, they're, they're darker right there, right in the corner of it. Go up a little more, there's two more in this one. The one to the right is the <laughs> circle. One of the uh, maintenance oh, foremen that used yeah. to work here a long time ago. He was saying that that was the gathering of the four clans. Which four clan may be Coyote Bighorn, Fire Clan, Eco Clan, Badger Clan, Flute Clan. Then over here is, he was saying that might be indicating the generation. One, two, three, four, maybe five generations. Mm. Going back to like 1,800 <clears throat> to 1,150, 1,150. From there to 1,250. From there to 1,300. There's mm. four stages. Anything mm. before 1,000 is basket makers. Or it could be uh, the, the, the arrangement of stars at night. That's what somebody was saying. All of these dots, are those accidental or are those painted? <sighs> Might have had a party. <laughs> <laughs> Throwing contest. Throwing contest. Throwing contest. <laughs> Using the ho uh, Hopi way. After a wedding, they have a big fight, mud fight. Oh. Mm. <laughs> so that might come from the idea. Maybe. I or like it could that. be throwing contest. <laughs> the simplest explanation is often the right one. Uh -huh. The circle that divides the four parts is like four <gasps> clans. Okay. You see the circle? The four yeah. clans. Or it could have meant also, like in Navajo way, you have first world, second world, third world, we're in the fourth. Okay. And then the Hopi say they're in the fifth world. <clears throat> so this might be the fourth world here. Out where they live now is the fifth world. <clears throat> Some of the seasonal ranger come on duty and they don't know anything. Yeah. <laughs> and they said the head of the chiefs all live on this side? How many rooms would be here? Five. This is five. Yeah. Oh, oh, I see, okay. They could keep their eye on everybody. Yeah. How did they hold it together? Mm, twigs. Uh, Broadleaf yucca. Where the two straight wall is in the corner, there's one stick sticking out. The next one over is a turkey pin. Is a what? Turkey pin. The